So I just use uh, the Malaro oil to prep your skin. This is uh, all natural oil. Okay, I get a little bit on your neck as well. Okay, then we start from the neck. We use this too. This is a very good shape with the notch. We use the long edge first, and from the side. The angle should be fatter. Mm. You can do five to nine times. You can also wiggling it to massage it. Mm. When you at the line, you start from the collarbone, which is a little bit on it to ground it and then start to do this until you reach the jawline then we can do the middle you can use this and then you can use the notch and to start from this side the, under the chin along your jawline and you can also do a little bit of massage by wriggling here because here you have two very important acupressure points and then you can start from the mouth press a little bit on the lips use it with really light pressure and the angle is really flat and you can use another edge, the short edge, to do under your cheekbone. And when you reach your hairline, you can always massage by wriggling it. Or sometimes you can use your hands to give a little bit of soothing. Your hand is just to follow the motion and direction. Of the guasa too. I use this rose quartz guasa too, but there are a lot of other type of J stone. So up to your own preference. When you do your eyes, you have to be really, really light. Use feather like pressure. You just do a little bit of um, grounding with your fingers. It can help mobilize the chi and blood flow. And when you do the eyebrow, you can use the notch again. There is a point here, you can press the point. If we have dry eyes or tiring eyes, and this, you can also use your finger to massage it yourself sometimes, like doing mm. this. But if you have this guasa too, you can do it this way. Again, very, very light pressure. You follow your eyebrow and then you go upwards to reach your hairline and then you can wiggling it a little bit when you reach your hairline okay and then we do the forehead the forehead you use the long edge or the short edge is up to you you just start from the middle part you can do five to nine times very flat angle medium pressure when you reach the hairline, you can do some wriggling to massage your skull. Okay, we finished half face. How do you feel? Do you see the difference? Isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's much more lifted on this side. Yeah. It's a little bit saggier here. Mm -hmm. If you can do it like, you know, um, one to three times a week, you know, it will have accumulative effect. It will be even better. It's better than Botox. It's all natural. Mm. It's more slender. And this is fluffier still <laughs> okay mm -hmm. interesting thank you for following us